Have you seen a squirrel? You would surely have. Between trees, bushes, mostly in a hurry and full of mischief. This is the squirrel, the Indian palm squirrel. It has three stripes on its back. These squirrels are sacred in India and not to be harmed, mainly due to its association with Lord Rama. So today, let us hear the story of how squirrels, the Indian palm squirrels, got the three stripes on its back and why they are sacred in India. Long ago in ancient India, the ten-headed wicked demon, Ravana, kidnapped Prince Rama's wife, Sita, and took her to his kingdom in Lanka, across the ocean. Rama, along with his brother Lakshmana, went in search of his beloved wife. On the way he met the Vanara king Sugriva, who agreed to help fight against the powerful Ravana. To reach Lanka where Sita was kept, Rama and the Vanaras had to cross the ocean. So, they decided to build a bridge across. The Vanaras were a strong race. They carried huge boulders and rocks on their shoulders and dropped them on the ocean to build the bridge. They shouted in excitement of helping Rama. A small squirrel was watching this huge effort and wanted to contribute too. He started carrying small pebbles lying on the shore and dropped them in the ocean. After a while, he was too tired to carry pebbles but still wanted to contribute. He then wet his body in the ocean and rolled on the sand and came back to the ocean and dropped the sand on the bridge construction. <laughs> the Vanara saw the hurrying squirrel and started laughing loudly. They shouted at the squirrel. What is the use of the grains of sand, tiny fellow? Look at us, bringing boulders and rocks for the bridge. Clear our way and allow us to do some meaningful work. The squirrel did not respond, but calmly continued with his work. <coughs> Angered, one of the Vanaras picked the squirrels and threw him to the shore. Rama was watching this and immediately caught hold of the squirrel before he got injured by hitting the ground. He turned to the Vanara army and addressed to them, Oh dear Vanaras, you are doing a great job. You are indeed strong and brave. But you see, the tiny grains of sand brought by the little squirrel is filling the gaps in between the rocks and making the bridge strong. Please do not be angry and scold the little helper with a large heart. (laughs) 
Hearing this, the Vanaras realized they were rude and wrong. They bow down to Rama and the squirrel in apology. Rama then turned to the squirrel and said, My dear friend, thank you for the help you have offered to me. I am sorry that my army hurt you. But now they understand your sincerity and want you to be in their team. Saying this, he gently stroked the back of the squirrel with his fingers and three lines appeared where the Lord's fingers had touched it. Thus, the squirrels got the three stripes on their backs as a blessing from Lord Rama to remind us that no task, however small, but if sincere, is unimportant. Every task should be looked upon as a service to the Lord, and His blessings will always be with us.